What's up, Gemini? It's your girl, Isabella Tara Tarot, back at it again, and hit you with your daily message. Thank you so much for all the likes, shares, subscribes, love donations. You guys are greatly appreciated. All the information to reach me as far as my personals will be in the description box below, um, along with my Etsy shop. That'll be in the link as well. Um, my cash app is Isabella T. Tarot. Or PayPal me at paypal.me slash I-S-S-E-Y-T-A-R-A. Anyways, we're going to go ahead and get up in here. So, before I get in to the spread that I pulled up, I feel for the Gemini. Like, the song that I got when I was ready, ready to like really get into y'all's energy was Cardi B. Okay? And her song was like, Get Up 10. Like 10. There's something significant for you in the number 10. Okay? Um, especially because it came out in my little in my little shuffle, like 10 of Pentacles. So get up 10. And that was definitely talking about finances, okay? So I feel like some of you are really coming into a lot of um financial stability in this time, okay? Um, like, I feel like some of you are possibly going to get to a level, like, I feel like a lot of you have, like, cleared out some kind of generational curses. Like, I feel like you're the one in your family that may be making it to possibly, like, uh, like, six figures. Like, I feel like a lot of, like, uh, rags to riches situation like I feel like some of y'all are really having a come up and people are really like seeing it right now okay like she had said bitches stab you in the back while they smiling in your face like that right there like talking shit putting putting shit like always talking shit they always got something to say and I feel like some of y'all are ready to fight <laughs> Some of y'all, it's like y'all come into, you know, a certain, um, like, I feel like, I feel like you're coming into a very solid, stable point in your life to where, you know, you're comfortable or you're happy. Like, I feel like it's been a while since you've just been happy, okay? Like, with this focused intention, like, you've been, you've been focused, focused, man, like, you have been focused on your happiness. Like, I'm, <laughs> I'm seeing her and, like, I'm noticing her headband in this situation. Like, a lot of, like, I feel like a lot of you have actually gotten really focused in regards to um, your physical body. Like, you're changing things up in the way that you move. All right? And I heard stealthy. So, I feel like a lot of you, it's like you're doing what you want. And it's like you may have, like, luxury items or luxurious things. But it's like I don't feel like you're being flashy with it. I feel like you're doing it because it makes you happy. And not necessarily for, like, the ego purposes. Not, not for, not to be seen. Like, I really don't feel like you're doing it to be seen, okay? Like, I feel like you're going, like, it's like you have your goals, like, goal setting. Like, I feel like you have that in your mind's eye of what you want, and you're going to get it, like, regardless. I feel like every other thing, like, I feel like you might have been the type to multitask and have, like, 12 different things. You have learned to get to the end result that you're, like, you, you are, like, expecting for yourself you have to cut out some of the excess noise so you can be clear, okay? And I've had inner wisdom on bottom. Like, what's not seen is you know what to do. Trust your inner wisdom and take appropriate action without delay. So, the time is now. Like, I feel like the timing is now. Like, the timing could not be better for you. Like, I feel like things are just starting to fall into place where, where they're supposed to. Like, I feel, did we get that card the other day? I feel like the like those are redundant. That's very weird. Purification. It's time. Look, have you not, look every time I say something, time. Like I keep getting drawn back to time. Like did I say that yesterday? I feel like a, because I keep saying this, I'm like a lot of y'all are probably actually experiencing deja vu or you know having visions in this time. Okay. 
Like, I feel like spirit is trying to speak to you through these visions, through the pet the repetitive um, energy that they keep displaying for you because they want you to do something differently. All right. Okay. So it's time for you to, um, for a cleansing detoxification of your body and mind. Didn't I just say something about exercise? Like, I feel like y'all are in this energy of getting right. Okay. Like, I feel like you might have been, you know, slacking a little bit, you know, eating not the best. And I feel like you're actually going to start being a little bit more mindful of what you're putting inside of your body. Like, some of you are actually looking into detoxes right now, trying to detox, you know, all of the, um, toxic products and or you, you may be you know switching to that deodorant that doesn't have whatever the hell in it you know um changing the products that you use on your hair and getting better results like changing the products that you put on your skin and it like it's making your skin softer there was something that you were using on a daily basis that was dehydrating you by the way look i'm getting like a heavy emphasis around water a lot of you need to be focusing, look, a detox, a detox bath, purification baths, purification baths, cleansing, detoxification, that seashell behind her head, I'm just noticing, like, y'all are detoxing stressful people, stressful situations, stress is causing a lot like, you may not even realize you're harnessing as much stress as you are, but that is also um, affecting your health in this time. Like, the stress that is not being resolved is affecting you emotionally, is what I'm getting drawn to with all the water and the Ace of Cups. Like, I feel like that also, like, you need a detox. If you could do a detox, you, you should probably really focus on that in this time because I really feel like all that stress is affecting you emotionally like I feel like you may be lashing out at people because I did get kind of like aggression like being ready to fight as far as listening to that song like ready to fight like ready to throw hands okay um possibly be dealing with mood swings it's like you could like be dealing with like feeling so happy for a certain amount of time and the next thing you know somebody says something you ready to fucking you know knock them knock knock, knock somebody out okay like I feel like it's time for you to balance your energies. Like you need to um, clear out what is causing stress in your life. Whether that be, you know, cleaning your house, cleaning your space, um, or, you know, changing up your, your group of friends. But it's like, you know this. It's like, I feel like there is some kind of repetitive thing that you've been doing. Poss if, this is, if this is in regards to like diet and exercise, there's this repetitive um, it's almost like an addiction type thing. Like, this, but when I say addiction, it could just be like too much sweets or addicted to caffeine or addicted to sweets or there's some kind of addiction that's really affecting you in regards to your, I heard gut health. Um, but I really feel like you need to start drinking more water and balancing out your energies. And that's going to affect how you respond to things that are causing you stress in your life right now. Because I feel like there are quite a few different things that are causing you stress right now. But they're telling you to remain focused because you are... You're actually going somewhere with this. Like, I feel like you are about to be really, like, rewarded financially because of all of the hard work and the hard, like, the effort that you're putting in to a certain situation. Because you've cut out all of the distractions and really, like, really fucking going for it. That's why you're about to be blessed with, like, resources. Very tangible resources, might I add. Like... Like, I feel like somebody's about to try to contact you possibly with a business proposal or offer you something in regards to your business that's going to be very lucrative. It's like it's something that's going to definitely add to you, add to your resources. So, look, is that a, like that, that could be a phone call? That could just be someone, you know, messaging you digitally. 
Um, I really feel like it's digitally reaching out to you digitally in some way to collaborate. Like I feel like somebody wants to work with you and they're going to actually be bringing something to the table. Okay. Let's see. Let's clarify this Ace of Cups over here. What did Gemini? Some of y'all cut out a Pisces or a water sign. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, I feel like there was some kind of relationship that you cut out that was actually like somebody still. Oh God, quit writing me. Hold on a second. There is a relationship that you cut out, okay, with this water sign. And I feel like they're basically saying that you're about to be blessed because of it. I feel like <laughs> I heard a random message like spirit was actually not, yeah, they were holding you back. They wasn't going to let you come into, you know, your inheritance, your blessings, all the things that you were meant for in life until you let go of that person. And I feel like um, because you finally draw, somehow this person has been purged from your energy, whether you've stayed focused on cutting this person off, um, you're about to start hearing about this, this, this blessing. It's like it's something that's been like been lingering for a while now but it's like you you haven't fully like you never really fully detached from this person i feel like you're finally making it to that point where these blessings can now be be they can be offered to you okay like i feel like there was something spirit was definitely holding something back from you and now they're coming through giving it to you they were like and i really feel like it's material it feels like it's material like there's going to be some kind of windfall, like a serious windfall for you guys. Um, because that, like, whoever that water sign was, was, was leeching off your energy. And it's like they were taking from you. So, spirit was never going to allow you to have, you know, wasn't going to be sitting here giving you stuff for somebody else to keep depleting. Like, it was, it would have been an, un, like... It would have been a cycle, a never-ending cycle, and you'd never get anywhere. Like, I feel like Spirit, you know, pulled them resources back from you to kind of put you in a state like this to realize that you are not going to keep working with someone who is just going to keep depleting you and putting you in this Five of Pentacles situation. Like, I feel like you got really smart in regards to a relationship and a situation and stepped away. I feel like some of you are having to, like I heard, regenerate, rejuvenate because of the emotional, um, the star flew out, but I'm not bending all the way down to pick that one up. i get that one. Nope, I won't. I guess I'll throw it away. <laughs> ah, look, but what came out again? Okay, I just, I, I didn't realize it came out like that, so I guess I'm supposed to take these. These were the only two that got left on the, um. Why is my dog going crazy? Alright. Um. Yeah. Like, I'm. Why am I? I'm getting a sense of somebody being kicked the fuck out. Somebody got kicked out. Like. <laughs> I feel like you rejected this individual. Like, I feel like you had to reject this individual. Okay. Um, for your wishes to come true or for your wishes to be granted for those of you who are practicing and were wondering why you weren't seeing any kind of, you know, it's like I feel like you were possibly doing the same spell work over and over and over and you're like, why is this not working? Why am I not getting my desired results? It's because you didn't completely, like you didn't cut off, like you weren't doing what you were supposed to do for spirit to allow it to fall together because it's like you were holding on to something that would harm or keep taking away whatever it is they were trying to assist you with to bring to you. It's like you had to completely reject this person and get them out of your energy field before they was ever going to allow you to come up. Like, I feel like you're finally, look, coming to an emperor status or empress. Um, 
boss like like a boss like bossed up energy like i feel like you have fired like <laughs> somebody got fired okay like okay somebody got fired Somebody got fired. I don't know if you are a boss and you fired somebody, but somebody got fired. I feel like this individual who was also leeching off your energy had also been pulling the good shit from you too, okay? So while they were in your energy field, they were getting blessings in their life that they didn't deserve, bitch. Like, I, that's what I really just got. Like, they were getting blessings. They were being put in positions that they, there's no way, there's no reason they should have even been in those positions. But the only reason they were in those positions was because they were still attached to your energy. That's why you were feeling so drained. That's why you were feeling like you didn't have or, or couldn't do all this stuff. It's like this person was leeching off your energy, taking from you, and they were coming up all the while. And then spirit, your spirit was not having that. Like, your spirit was just like, okay. They ain't gonna listen to me, so let me start taking some stuff back until they can figure out what's cause what's causing this to happen. Okay, so I really feel like spirit has come in and forced you to possibly go through some trials and tribulations and hard, awkward situations like between a rock and a hard place, so you would boss up and so you would leave this person. Okay. And now you're in that boss position, you done fired an individual, but I feel like they're also getting fired because of what I heard, like I was just like, <clears throat> this person was getting financial blessings that they did not deserve because they were somehow in your energy field. They were sucking from you. They were depleting you. And now that you've taken that energy back, I feel like you're going to start seeing like serious ass shit happening with your money things to celebrate coming together. Like I feel like a lot of your houses are coming together. You're cleaning. Um, Like I just, I'm, I'm feeling like hardcore cleaning, and it's not spring cleaning because it's not spring, but it's like I really feel like a cleansing of your space. That's what you've been focused on is cleansing the energy around you, cleaning, cleaning your space, cleaning your floors, cleaning your walls, cleaning out the clutter, donations, like giving things away, purging things, and starting fresh. Like I feel like. That is the best thing for you, okay? And I do feel like this person was getting, like, having financial blessings because of leeching off your energy. And now you're about to see what state that this person actually is in because you have dropped their energy. Because you've dropped them. You're about to see, like, I feel like this person is about to start looking old, old, tattered, Wearing crazy clothes because, like, I say crazy clothes. It doesn't matter what they wear, but I really feel like you're going to see it. Like, it's going to be visual who this person is because I feel like you're going to see them go from, like, a 10 to a 5. <laughs> Literally, from a 10 to a 5. Like, how did they fall off this quickly? Like, it's going to happen fast. Um, But it's, like... It's karma. It's like everything coming full circle and like being exposed. It's 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 the energies like being righted. Like I feel like the scales were unbalanced for so long and now that they're finally being balanced, who's who is really going to be shown here? Like the people who have been working on themselves and really focusing on their blessing, their come up are going to be blessed and you're going to be seeing that in this time and the people who are sitting here mooching stealing leeching like just leech ass energy like those people are about to be exposed like you're going to be seeing them really fall off in the next few days is what i'm feeling like fast 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 definitely within a week like you're going to be seeing like this person's going to start aging possibly start balding like Somebody lost their job, okay? Somebody definitely lost their job. And somebody's definitely homeless because of losing a job. But it's just like, with you pulling your energy back, you're about to see all these blessings start coming in because of all the hard work that you put in. It's like, no, people are not going to just benefit off of you anymore. 
I really, I really feel like that is dead. That is done. That is that cycle that you've gotten through. Like nobody is going to be able to collect on your inheritance at this point because, you know, you've bossed up. It really just feels like you're in this boss energy, and it's like you are not backing down. You know which steps to take. I feel like, um, like I, I really feel like you've gotten really wise. Um, in a very short amount of time as well. Okay. It's really what I'm getting. But anyways, that's y'all's message. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.